Hello folks, Ryan here with Natural Aquariums, and if you watched my last video, it featured this tank here that um, was my submission for the secret history living inside your aquarium aquascaping contest that focused on some immersed growth as you see in the back here and across the top of the water. Um, now this uh, little tank uh, unfortunately didn't win the competition, wasn't uh, second or third, there was many many uh, great submissions by um, some fantastic aquascapers and hobbyists uh, around the country and, and around the world. Um, it was really interesting to see the, uh, the different aquascapes that people had and, and it looked like there was a lot of other people that learned a lot from this competition other than just me. Um, now what I did win was a special prize given by Alan Bauer um, for some uh, immersed grown crypts and so that's in this box here and so what I thought we'd do today is just uh, unbox this and uh, see what I got. So I mentioned that there's um, some immersed grown crypts uh, that should be in this box but I didn't really mention why uh, I won those, what the criteria was. So I um, wanted to let you know that the that this was a special prize that was given for the um, I think best use of cryptocorn in this aquascaping contest. So just wanted to provide a little bit of clarification there before we unbox it. Of course, I've taken the addresses off there to protect uh, both myself and Alan uh, from revealing our identities. So uh, totally. Um, so let's hack in here and see what's going on inside. Um, now, Alan was very nice. He had uh, given me a, a, a few options of um, these uh, kind of rare crypt species or um, a couple of books that sounded really interesting about uh, um, plants from um, mainland Malaysia. So uh, me being a plant guy, I just couldn't resist the plants and had to go with that. So we got a little insulation in here sneak a bag out <clears throat> and then yeah I don't know if maybe you can see that name there I'm not sure if I can read that just on camera here cryptocorin Ferengenia purple wow looks like there's a several bags in here cryptocorin Yuji? Yeah. I mean, these are just species that I have not heard of. Um, so, if anyone can help me with pronunciations in the comments, certainly appreciate it. Here's another crypt species. You tell me. <laughs> Very funny. I like that. I don't know if you guys could see the name on the first one. I'm not sure if I had the camera set up quite right there. There's that first one. Cryptocorn, <laughs> you tell me. I like that. Hmm. Philodendron species pink princess. Not aquatic. Okay. Interesting. See a big leaf kind of sticking out the corner there. And I'll pull these apart and uh, can we get a little closer look here too. Cryptocorn pygmaea. Nice. And yeah, I think that's it. But that's wonderful. Look at uh, what we get. One, two, three, four. Five different species so yeah let me get these out of the um, bags and kind of organize them a little bit and we'll take a little closer look at uh, how they came in how they survived the shipping and uh, what they look like all right so I got these all unpackaged and uh, yeah just laid them in this little tray I'll probably be planting these in this little tray for the time being it's got a lid it's just a kind of like a little mini greenhouse um, but yeah, got my water here, gave them a little mist down to keep them nice and moist. 
uh, looks like everything showed up just in really wonderful shape and uh, some wonderful plants. So let's take a little closer look here. Um, this is that first plant that I had uh, picked up. Um, I don't know if you can really, you can start to see it there. You can see, you know, the uh, the leaves got a little pattern onto them. It's like a little variegation there and stuff. So interesting plant. This is that uh, cryptocorn uh, Furingia purple. So next up, there's a couple of stems of these here. Um, just grab one of them to show you. This is that cryptocorn Yuji. Y-U-J-I-I. -I. Yeah, cool looking plant. Look at the undersides of the leaves. So yeah, there's that one. And then the second plant here. This here. This one is the mystery plant here the cryptocorn species you tell me so yeah i'll let you guys play as well you tell me or maybe i'll uh do some research and see if i have a guess and put it down here some text or something but just uh yeah nice big plant some new growth coming up here. Healthy white roots. Now this one is the non-aquatic species and boy it's a bummer that it's not. I mean look at this, you know. These leaves have this insane pattern on here. This is the philodendron species pink princess. So, just a fascinating plant, and yeah, look forward to growing that out of water. These are probably all going to start out of water, and eventually I may try to transition them. And the uh, last one here is that uh, Cryptocorn Pygmaea. So, once again, another uh, couple of stems of this, or a couple of plants, I should say. They're not stem plants. Um, but just yeah, get a little closer look at this one here. Nice looking plant. Good healthy roots. Yeah, so I think uh, that'll about do it. Thanks for checking it out and hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you feel the need to click those buttons down there, go ahead and do so. Otherwise, we'll talk to you later. Thanks. Bye.